Hey guys, just a quick video about uh, your KCET examination of mathematics which went today. Yes, the paper was a little bit difficult and lengthy too in the same time. That is the review which I uh, majorly got from the people whom I got in touch with. I had been to one of the centers near my home and uh, even people there were of the same opinion that questions were a little bit lengthy and in the same time uh, they were a little bit difficult to in terms of level of difficulty. First question in your mind, I mean the first question which is commonly appearing for me now is whether they will be giving grace marks for questions which are out of syllabus or which were from the deleted portion of your syllabus. And the second question is about whether the cutoff will go low uh, or whether this difficulty and this ambiguity in the paper uh, impact the cutoff. I will be answering both of them very quickly. Answering your first question, I think uh, it, is, it will become too early if I do it now because there will be a thorough review which will be happening on your paper in which they will be verifying if the questions were actually out of the syllabus or actually not from the syllabus which was prescribed for KCET 2024 this time. Uh, with the small developments which will take place in that aspect, I will be giving you updates in this channel itself. Uh, so I think the first question will remain unanswered for now. But if that is the case, if uh, the verification takes place and if it's legitimately known that those questions were not the part of the syllabus which was prescribed, then you will surely get grace marks for it. Okay, that is done. Next question is about uh, the impact on cutoff. Yes, if most of the people feel the same about the ambiguity in your mathematics paper or if many of you feel that uh, the paper difficulty was a little bit high then that will certainly impact the cutoff because when it's lengthy and when it's difficult at the same time there won't be a lot of students who will be uh, doing really good in this or performing really good in this and that will certainly bring the cutoff a little bit down but uh, again it is too early to discuss about all of this but still know this if that is the thing then cutoff will also surely decrease and you'll be awarded grace marks and now is the important thing which i had to tell you guys please don't let this impact your performance for tomorrow if you have done well today then that's great and even if you haven't uh, made justice or if you aren't satisfied with your performance today then also it's fine guys please just forget what has happened today please this is one favor which i'm asking from you please i request you to just forget whatever happened today sitting in sitting in this end and telling you to forget everything and just focus on tomorrow i know it's not that easy but still please force yourself to just come out of what happened today and just uh, focus on tomorrow and just start your revision as soon as possible without uh, searching for answer keys or paper reviews i don't want uh, uh, I am not a big fan of that and I, I have told you about why I don't uh, encourage those things and that is the reason why I didn't upload any videos regarding your answer keys too. Everything has a certain uh, block of time in which those things have to be done. It doesn't hold any meaning of doing it in other times just for the sake of uh, weaves or something else. So yes guys, I hope you guys will take my favor seriously and please provide it so that both of us will be benefited from it. Don't just uh, be in that uh, zone wherein you will be thinking of what may happen to physics and chemistry. Mathematics only went off so will physics and chemistry also appear in the same manner. Oh, uh, that is the thing which will be there in your mind. I could relate to this cause even I had uh, uh, messed up with my mathematics examination in which I had uh, finally I managed to score only 29 and I was really worried about physics and chemistry too. Then I just uh, told myself to give my best in physics and chemistry and uh, rest is what happened. I scored really well in both of them for what I had prepared. So everything is there. No answer keys, no uh, paper reviews or no uh, tricks and all seeing now. Just focus on tomorrow and focus on giving your best tomorrow. Thank you.